Mr. Ron is known for cartwheels, so we're gonna do cartwheels. We're gonna start very basic, okay? So, one thing different from the way I do cartwheels and a gymnastics cartwheel is I'm always looking to the front, all right? Whether I'm playing capoeira and somebody's kicking at me or I'm dancing on stage, I wanna see the audience. I want the audience to see my face. Or if I'm battling somebody in a circle, I wanna look at them. I wanna see the fear in their face, okay? So we're here. And I'm gonna start by turning my foot the direction I wanna do my cartwheel. All right, we're gonna start very simple. Now, this hand, first hand is gonna go out, but not in line with this foot. It's gonna go slightly behind, all right? Now, the fingers are out, spread out nice and easy. And what I want you to work on is stretching this out. Don't turn this way. This is a beginner mistake. If you go this way, try to reach over. All right, keep the chest open. Look at your screen while you're practicing this. All right, boom, like that. Now, what I want you to do is take this foot, bring it over to the other side, past the hand, and all the way to the other side of the hand, and then bring this one through like that. Now I'm back in this position again. So, again, boom. So I want to practice good fundamentals. Hand down, open the body up. Other hand goes down. So they should be pretty much in line. If you're here, you're gonna throw off your cartwheel. My hands are not in line, it's gonna, you'll feel that. So try to open the body up, bring the leg through. So if you watch that foot, you see I turn it when I get there and I'm bringing it up right there. Bam, do that 10, 15, 20, 30 times until you feel comfortable. Once you feel comfortable, you can start to lift the foot off the floor. So same exact thing, one, two, three, but now, this travels over. Bang, bang. Notice this bends as I come out, and I can bring my body back up. You wanna have control of it the whole time. Open the door, hand down, body open, bang. Lift the leg up, and bring it back, okay? Once you feel comfortable, with the slow lift, you can start to do a hop. All right, act like there's like a box there or a pillow. You could actually put something there. But you're gonna go from here, one, two, three. And then bring it over. Practice three, landing the opposite direction, okay? But close to your hand. So, one, two, three. And you have that little hop. All right, once you feel comfortable with that, you can start to go with the momentum. So, I'm going, and I start to write it in cursive. It all flows together. I'm not stopping in between. So again, got it? I'm gonna turn this way because I want you to see my feet in relationship to my hand. So I'm here, my hand is about here. Boom, boom. All right, it's not out here. That's harder to control. So you wanna try to get that foot as close to your hand width wise as you can. That makes sense? So I'm gonna do it one more time. This time I'm not gonna do the hop. So, coming here, small amount of width. I'm not way out here with my foot. Boom, boom. Right there. Because I really wanna keep my hips over top of my hands so I can have as much control as possible. All right, now we're gonna do what I call the chalk line. So we're gonna trace and make a big arc over and follow with the other leg. So I'm going one, two. This leg goes up. Work on your flexibility. Bring it all the way through. Up. Bam. So you just made two arches. Okay, coming back the other way. Bop. One, two. So I'm gonna bring this up as much as I can. Control it all the way to the other side. I watch where the foot lands. Boom and up, all right? Now there, you basically have your cartwheel once you can control that, okay? So if I do that with a little momentum now, I'm here, right there, and, and I'm watching where I land my feet. Right through, all right? Right there, okay? Because then I can start to add the power because I've worked on stretching through the whole time. So my body is now informed where it should go even when I'm moving faster. So I'm here, right there, 
so my body knows where to go with the added pressure of speed, okay? So I hope this helps you. This is my basics for cartwheels.